Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today I got something very special to share with you guys. So, uh, from time to time in Master Duel, I like to browse around and just check out what other people are playing, sometimes to get ideas, sometimes see cool duels. Now, most of the time, it's going to be meta, um, you know, when I'm playing at the higher ranks of the game. So, at the lower ranks, there's more creative decks. But this guy over here, Duelist B, I think he's one of the smartest Yu-Gi-Oh! players I've seen in gold. One of the most creative decks in a while. Um, this is going to be something super hard to pull off, so don't see this thinking you're gonna be able to pull it off you gotta have the big brain iq plays like duelist b over here uh really really big brain plays smartest Yu-Gi-Oh player in gold confirmed over here so anyways he's playing a deck which looks a little bit interesting i see that there's baboo and i see sangan but the thing that caught my eye over here the reason why i wanted to uh, go through with this is i saw the sasuke samurai i'm like okay let, let's see if he can pull it off if you guys don't know that's one of the most broken cards when it inflicts battle damage the player that takes the damage draws seven cards. Obviously drawing seven, I mean, Pot of Greed at three doesn't even draw seven. It is one of the most insane cards, but it's not easy to pull off. But I was thinking in my head, if he pulls it off, it's awesome. Normally I would just take this, because uh, this was actually taken during my live stream. I stream Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel from time to time, as well as other games. But uh, I was playing some music that was copyrighted. It was the Spider Rider intro. Shout out to you guys that know that anime. Great classic anime. Uh, Spider Raiders, I was pl playing the music from that, but anyways, I see Guardian Slam, I'm like, oh, is this like a Winged Dragon or Raw Sphere Mode or something like that? I didn't really know what the deck is. Heck, I still don't even know his full deck because, unfortunately, with Master Duel and the, uh, deck, uh, section when you, like, if you could even save the, uh, replay like you could in, like, EDO Pro, that would've been awesome. So he ends up swapping cards, uh, over there, he, uh, actually has his Sangan on the opponent's board, it doesn't really matter, he's gonna get the effect of Sangan, even though it was on his opponent's board, but... Please, Master Konami, if you're if you're listening to some feedback here, make it so if we spectate these duels, we can view the deck list. I would love to see what the heck this deck was because it was so wild that I'm just like, how does someone come up with this? All right, so watch what this guy does because it's not easy again to pull it off. But then he surprised me again at the end with what actually happens in this duel. So Baboon activates a card that just kind of cycles. It puts one card back, lets you draw one, and just lets you cycle through cards. Uh, I see the Ring of Destruction, and he can actually get some pretty insane amounts of attack. So he activates Ring of Destruction, so he pops um, the opponent's card. Both players take the damage. And I was like, what is this, some like burn varying deck? It didn't really make sense, but it, it kind of makes sense a little bit more towards the end. So he draws another Tragodia, and then it makes this play, which was really like, what? I did not even expect this. So. He's got Trigodi, and I'm thinking that he's going to eventually draw a bunch of cards. Sasuke Samurai, and that's going to be game. But that's not actually what happened. So the guy in the back, Duelist A, he's playing some variant of a, a trap monster deck. And so he tributes double for Trag, and I was like, wait, that's a terrible play. But he ends up getting it uh, flipped face down with the Acid Trap Hole. Uh, but he still has another Trigodi. He actually is doing this on purpose, so you can actually draw maximum potential for a later play down the line. So he draws Sheehan Spy, and then I kind of see what's going on. So he special summons the Jester Confit. He's activating Sheehan Spy. The guy changed Twister. Duelist A, probably low-rated Duelist. I don't even know what rank this was in, but, I mean, Duelist B was in gold, at least at the uh, time of me viewing his profile, he ends up giving him Sasuke Samurai. So now he's gonna crash the Jester combat into him. He actually summons the Exodus Forbidden Lord, resetting all the cards. Now he's gonna take the damage, summons the Trag off of the same damage so he can actually draw seven instead of six because it actually works like that which i actually was impressed that he was able to pull that off in gold he activates msc draws into it pops the unknown so he doesn't have to deal with it insane stuff and i'm like okay this could it get any better he's resetting cards more further to even make c9 dyson spear so he can even take more monsters because at the start of uh damage type the battles it you just gonna attach it onto material and then you can also do burn damage you can inflict damage to your opponent i was just like i couldn't believe it here and then he surprises me again with the amoeba play who plays amoeba in 2022 and makes a game activates mystic bots swaps the cards with him and his opponent just takes the burn damage and i was just like okay this is too good i gotta put this on the channel but anyways hopefully you guys enjoyed something completely random and weird uh crazy stuff yo shout out to duelist b over here but subscribe to the channel if you're new and want to see more videos like this in the future crazy stuff but thanks for in. i'll catch you guys in the next video i'm out peace amoeba in 2022 man